Ryan Steineker with Cody Lundgren, head coach of the Rich Lady Rebels. Coach, 2-1 uh, and one weekend of the preview. How are you feeling about that? I was very happy with how our girls went out there and played. And, you know, they, they got going as a team a lot of times and played hard. And it was, it was good to see. Scored a lot of points against Paiute. Your defense looked good against Milford. Uh, Bryce Valley, I mean, what was your take on that game? You know, we came out in the first half, and, uh, you know, they were just a little bit more physical than us in that first half, and we didn't match their their physical intensity until, you know, we, we talked at halftime, and, you know, we just talked to the girls about matching the, their physicalness, and, you know, I thought we did a lot better in the second half. You had a lot of open shots from 7 or 10 feet that just wouldn't go down, it felt like, in that first half as well. Yeah, we had a lot of great looks, Ryan. You know, it, we had the great looks. You just There's a lid on the basket, and some nights that happens. And w- when that happens, you just got to keep fighting. Overall, though, I was impressed. And, uh, I mean, if, if I was looking, putting myself in your shoes, I think, I think I'd be happy about the weekend, how the girls played. Yeah, you know, they, they executed our sets very well, I thought. And they, they took what the defense gave them, and we didn't really force anything. You know, our turnovers were pretty low for you know our, our first games of the season which I was happy with and um, we just got a few other small things to straighten out and we'll keep working on things and keep getting better getting ready uh, I guess your next game is at North Summit the 2A volleyball champs against the 1A volleyball champs that'll be a good game yeah you know they they're a very athletic team they got they got some pretty special girls and they're coached by uh, coach Holmes and he's, he's a great coach and he, he he gets them ready to go anything specifically you're preparing for against them you know, they just like to play a, a fast-paced, up-tempo, athletic game, and we're going to try to prepare for some pressure and just get ready to handle that. You feel like, uh, I mean, any questions you may have had about your depth, I think, were answered against Milford when you didn't have three seniors there, and yet you guys still played well, played hard, and, and won the game. Yeah, you know, we got some very talented young girls, and it's going to make our bench pretty deep, and, you know, that's a good thing for us because, you know, we play a lot of a lot of weeks. We'll have three games in one week, and it being heavy on the bench like this, the, you know, the we should be able to play our style of ball and keep kids with uh, energy. Things you want to improve on from what you saw in those first three games? With the game with Milford, we we let their pressure kind of rattle us a little bit. I was I was proud in the third and fourth quarters though how our girls uh, slowed the, the pace down. They realized you know the that we were up in the game and pulled that defense out to us and. And then started working from there. So that was that was a real mature thing I saw this team do. And you know, against Bryce Valley, we, that was good for us to see. That we need to match some of that, uh, you know, physical and hustle, and and we'll keep working on those things. Anything else you want to touch on, Coach? No, thanks for being here, Cody Lundgren of the Rich Lady Rebels. Thanks for your time and best of luck uh, with the Thanksgiving break and get ready for your next game. Yeah, have a happy Thanksgiving to you, Ryan.